Hey, after dinner, you want to watch something? Like what? I don't know. Some on Netflix? What the fuck is Netflix? <laughs> Never mind. I heard a good joke today. So, horse walks into a bar, right? Why would a horse walk into a bar? To get a drink. It's a horse. He drink outside in a trough. Well, this horse wanted something stronger. Horses don't drink alcohol. This one does. And no one else in the bar is reacting to the fact that a horse walked in? Yeah. All right, yeah, a couple people react. They're real surprised, but then they get over it. <sighs> so, uh, horse walks up to the bartender and says, Hey, I would like a Jack and Coke. What, now the horse can talk? <laughs> can I just finish my joke? Let me tell you one. Go ahead. Knock, knock. Who's there? Do the dishes. Funny. <laughs> Better hide your toothbrush tonight. You know, maybe it's none of my business, but aren't you a little hard on Colt? You're right. Seriously? Yeah, none of your business. You know, he's just like you. He is nothing like me. Only reason this whole thing blew up is because you're both too stubborn to admit it's either one of your fault. That is absolutely not true. <laughs> OK. Let me ask you something. What would happen to this place if I died? After the party? <laughs> I mean, obviously, I would run it. What if we both died? What's happening here? Is this like a murder-suicide kind of thing? <laughs> Colt would sell all the livestock, sell the ranch, piss the money away, and no good would ever come of it. That's not true. A lot of strippers in Denver would get new boobies. Your brother is a 34-year-old child. I'm just trying to prepare him for the rest of his life. That means I had to push him. So be it. Well, you pushed him, all right. Pushed him right out the door. Congratulations, Pop. You win. Yeah, if it repeats like a little too fast to be like, huh? But other than that, man, it's dope as hell. You gotta check it out. Okay, that's it for now. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye-bye.